graduation night for a number of Tucson high schools. Almost 400 students got their diplomas at Cienega tonight. With about 800 family and friends packing the football stadium for graduation, lots of parties can be expected tonight. But an accident involving students last night serves as a grim reminder of the dangers of drinking and driving. Now your site's Christina Myers is here now with more. Christina. Stella, six Vail District students were injured in last night's crash, one of them with life-threatening injuries. People Say they believe drugs and alcohol were a factor. So, Vail district officials hope Cienega students are prepared to make better decisions tonight. Cienega students are familiar with the very real dangers of drinking and driving. Last month, two smashed cars on the football field, their friends laying injured and dead. One even airlifted from the scene and another arrested by sheriffs. But it was all a reenactment, and parents say it really worked. That made a huge impact on her seeing that firsthand about how that emergency situation works, and that caused lots of conversation between she and I. And many parents say that can Communication is key. Mom and dad got to be right there in his face all the time saying, Don't do that. See this wreck that happened last night? You know, don't do that. The remains of a rollover accident involving six Vail District students just last night are another reminder to Sienega graduates. After the cheers at the graduation ceremony, district officials know the celebrations will likely continue off the field. But Vail Communication Specialist Natalie Luna Rose says they want to, quote, remind all students and friends to be safe. And if they feel like they're in an unsafe situation, don't get in that car. Sienega students can also go on a trip to Disneyland that leaves tonight. It's offered as an alternative to partying. Christina Myers, Kega 9, on your side.